Hello everyone and welcome back to Lavellius Coloring. We are now in day 17 in this advent calendar that I am coloring and it is illustrated by Chihiro Shiyomi. I did buy it from her Etsy store so I will leave the link to her store and to this PDF down below in the video description. So day 17 is right over here. So I'm going to color the rest of this frame and then we'll see where we are in time and I'm going to see if I can color at least the wall part of that frame. So I will zoom you guys up closer and we will get started. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get started with the leaves over here. And I'm going to be using the olive greens. So I have here, and this is the Holbein Artist colored pencils. I have olive yellow 198, olive green 189, and fur green 288. So I'm going to start off with the olive yellow. Just get coloring in here. So, how is everyone doing? guys ready for Christmas probably gonna say this again in each of the videos <laughs> but oh my son Mason is here with us so he may pop up in the background but he is watching what is that uh, Mickey's uh, Christmas movies the once upon a Christmas and the twice upon a Christmas he's been obsessed with that movie <laughs> with both of those movies so he's been watching that a lot never really getting tired of it but it's okay you know, it's he's learning about Christmas and meaning of Christmas <laughs> especially that one with Huey, Dewey, and Louie you know when their day they're Christmas Day is like on repeat, the Groundhog Day. But yeah, so totally forgot where I was. I had to answer my son. He was asking me a question. Yeah, he's been asking me a lot of questions about Christmas, like when it's going to be, and <laughs> every time I tell him how many days is left, he doesn't, yeah, he still can't quite judge time, even though, like, he always asks me, like, like when I tell him it's time to brush his teeth, he's going to ask me how long is it going to take, and I'm like, it'll take about maybe two or three minutes. And he's like, he's like, is that long? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. Do you ask me an amount of time? I'll give you in minutes. But yeah, every time it's time to brush his teeth, he asks me the same thing. How long is it going to take? Yeah, it's it's fun seeing him question everything but sometimes I just don't have the answers <laughs> I like to pass it on to my husband like um, his flashlight he took it apart because you know, the batteries were dead already so he was looking at it he took it apart was asking me what some of the parts and you know, like what their functions were <laughs> and I'm all like yeah, go ask your dad he'll answer your questions I think did I do this one? I can't remember but yeah so excited I'm excited for the day um, cause it's always exciting to see your kid's face, you know, like when they open their presents, it's that early morning. I usually don't put out all the presents, um, until the night before Christmas, 
so when they see the tree before it's like you know like not that many gifts and then so when they wake up in the morning they would find the Christmas tree filled so I'm gonna go ahead and do the heart and I have a fuchsia 436 and cherry blossom 011 so I don't know if you can hear the wind blowing it's very windy I'm just glad that I'm feeling a lot better um, compared to how I was feeling this morning because this morning it was really bad uh, allergies for me my husband thinks because it started raining again um, and the sun's not going to be back I don't know how long it's going to rain I think all week and next week so hopefully my allergies would like go away in a few days we'll see it's an annoying like and like itch in the back of your throat and in your ear so but I'm just glad it like kind of went away right now so not so bothersome so I'm gonna go ahead and color in the red like berries so I'm coming back in with the cherry blossom 011 I have the signal red 043 and the raisin 486 I'm gonna go in with the signal red and just go over the whole thing and the ribbon I am going to color it the same as um, I'm gonna come in with the raisin the same as the other ribbon in the bottom part of the frame I'm trying to find a sharp sharp edge of the pencil right there so that was raisin coming back in with the signal red just going over the raisin and So I just wanted to say also um, while I make this advent video, if you're on Instagram and if you follow Effie Colors, she Effie she hosts like a color along every month and she's a very gracious host. She always posts on her live uh, is that the live story? Uh, every time someone posts something for her color along and she also does a end of the month video of everyone's work but if you do follow her uh, she had to create a new account because her old one was having so many glitches on it and Instagram wouldn't fix it for her so she decided to just go ahead and create a new account and then Instagram is going to let her change um, the name back to the original name that she has so um, her original name was at Effie Colors and that's colors with a U uh, and her new account is under at Effie underscore colors with a U so um, if you do follow her, please follow her new account. So again, it's at Effie underscore colors with that's colors with a U and then her name is going to change back to the original. It's yeah, so it'll help out so she can continue, you know, seeing your work for her color alongs and then she can post it. So I'm going to do the beads that are up here. So um, I'm going to be using raw umber and ivory. But yeah, she's just, she's always been such a sweetheart and such a sweet friend. So I want to help her out, um, especially, you know, with this thing with Instagram, you know, it's a connection to everyone and, you know, to the color along how, you know, she's hosting it too. And it's just, it brings everyone together and that's what her color alongs does 
for me too, you know, and for the community. So I'm gonna just color in the frame. A little bit. I'm gonna bring in the cool grain number four five three four. A little piece right there. Here in the corner. And I didn't go down here, so I'm just gonna. I'm gonna come in with the dark, I mean lamp black 511. And just. Oh, I forgot this part here. I'm just gonna color that in black. Yeah. So now I'm gonna go ahead and color in the gingerbread. So I have brown 099 and burnt umper 180. I'll start off with the brown. Just color it in. So I've been trying to catch up on my um, to watch videos on YouTube. So, so behind. And I didn't realize I was already tagged for some, um, to do some videos. I think one of the tags was for the 10 books I want to finish. Or eventually finish and I was tagged by Sam whose channel name is coloring dreams and doodles and the original tag uh, came from Mary whose channel's name is another little piece of my art and it's a some of them were doing it for the next year for 2021 but knowing how I color I am a slow colorist so uh, it'll be hard for me to finish a whole book. I mean the one book that I did finish which is the Astro Inklings from Tanya Bond. I did do a video of my finished colorings of hers if you're interested. It's I finished it back in or I posted it back in January because I did the last of the zodiac signs in December but yeah that one took me two years I think two or two and a half years to finish no two years so I did it in 2007 no 2018 no wait I forgot when I started it. It might have been two and a half years. So for 12 images, it took me two and a half years to finish that book. But they were all like, you know, profile, um, illustrations, and half of them were done with all with pencils. So But I, I do plan to do the, what is that, uh, the tag, so I'll do the video, I'm just not sure when, because I still have to look through my books to see what 10 books I would want to finish. I do know of a couple already, I do plan to, because there is a book that I was supposed to finish this year that I was doing as a buddy color with. T from T's World of Adult Coloring, but uh, I just couldn't get into coloring and finishing the book. The book is, sorry, I forgot the name of the book. So the book is The Ink House by Rory Dobner, and yeah, I completed about a third of the book. I didn't post some of the pictures that I did finish in there. There's some that are there's a lot of work in progress in that book, but I don't know. I didn't want to force myself because it would take the 
you know, take away the fun of coloring a book. I'd rather be inspired to color rather than forced to oh, force. I mean, I put it on myself to finish it, so <laughs> but I just wasn't feeling it, and I apologize to T because she's finishing her, so she's going to be having a video coming out on her channel of that book of her finished copy. I'm not sure if it's going to be this year or next year, but so proud of her because she finished the Gnomes in a Neighborhood coloring book too. And that's like how many pages? A lot of pages. And I thought um, in the beginning of the year, beginning of 2020, I thought maybe I could also finish that book, The Gnomes in the Neighborhood. I finished one page and I was like, no, <laughs> I know. After finishing up that one page, I, I couldn't, I couldn't continue with that, um, finishing off that book. But yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy seeing the books that I picked out to be my 10 books to finish. But it won't be finished by 2021, by the end of 2021. It will like eventually be finished. These are eventual books. <laughs> Or books that like I'll focus on after I finished one. I really don't see myself actually you know, like quitting coloring. I wish you know like I was thinking earlier. I wish I found this hobby earlier um, when I was younger. But so happy I. On this hobby now. So I think I'm done with the gingerbread. Okay, so for the bow, I'm going to come in Malachite Green 255 and then Fur Green 288. There. Yeah, so there's so many people that have done the tag already so I have to catch up and see their videos just so much to watch <laughs> but you know um, I did get kind of burned out with watching YouTube so I was all like I need to watch something else maybe mm. something like, uh, what did I watch? I'm going to go ahead and color the bow here and his hat. So I'm going to come in with the yellow ochre, 153. And I'm going to go this way. And I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, <laughs> the show that I was watching. Yeah, um, I, I was just getting burned out watching like YouTube, so and I didn't want to like get bored and not get bored, but like like just watch too much YouTube. I just needed to watch something else. Um, so I watched the British um, Bake Off with um but it was the christmas special so i haven't watched season three so that was up and i was like oh, i should i just need something different to watch other than coloring so i watched that one and i was glad i did because it was a lot of fun especially that you know there was an episode with the actors from dairy girls i think it's a netflix show i I believe it's an Irish or British show so 
I haven't watched it before and now I'm kind of interested and curious about that show so I probably will check them out but if you've watched it what do you guys think of that show and have you watched the what is that called the uh, British Bake Off <laughs> British Bake Bake Off I think that's right yeah. Cause I'm always on YouTube and I'm like, oh, I need to just, you know, just uh, watch something else. I've been wanting to watch Friends. So I'm going to come in now with the blue. So this is Spectrum Blue 345, Indigo 460. And I can't find, I have the whole DVD set, all 10 seasons. But it's in a box and I think my husband accidentally put it away in the garage and our garage is like really full um, ever since my mother-in-law moved in with us her stuff has been blocking a lot of our our stuff so it's like I can't find any of, of the boxes that I need to find like the ones with my friends DVD but uh, we just realized that we had HBO Max and we didn't know for we had had it for a couple months so I might go ahead and start watching friends there so this is Carmine 042 it's a good show to have like in the background just playing as you color because I already know I've watched those episodes over and over again like forever when it was on Netflix I watched again all season and I actually wanted to watch it watch all of the Thanksgiving parts but couldn't find my DVDs and totally forgot that I could probably watch it on YouTube just the um, little clips of it so um, yeah so I'm gonna color the ribbon the same as I did this ribbon over here and hopefully I can replicate it <laughs> okay so I'm gonna come in with malachite green 255 
I'm just gonna come back in with the what is this carmine since it's already out I'm just gonna color that one in and here's a cherry blossom and I'm gonna come in now with the pilot juice point three eight and I'm gonna darken up the number seventeen. Maybe the eyes too because I'll just come back with the lamp black and darken up. I'm going to use this yellow Sakura Stardust. This is number 703. And I'm going to follow the green plan. Right there. And then with the clear Stardust, uh, Sakura Stardust, this is number 700, I'm going to come in on these that I usually put glitter on and I'm going to put it on his button and I think... I'm going to come in with the cream 127 and just darken up these. Right there. Um, I think I'm just going to leave it right here. Um, I'm just going to do this part later on um, on day 20. Okay, so here is how the calendar is looking like. I am really enjoying this advent calendar. I love seeing it come together. I, I'm always worried before, like when I start a section, wondering if the colors I chose is going to work out. But so far, <laughs> it's going all right. Um, yeah, so we have seven days left. For this advent calendar then it's going to be christmas so i thank you guys so much for joining me for day 17 and coloring in chihiro shiomi's advent calendar i do hope that you guys are having fun seeing me color in this page so i will see you all at my next video and please take care keep safe and healthy and many happy colorings bye bye